Don't let the ages of my next two guests this morning fool you. They are already making a difference at the age of 10. That's right, just 10 years old. They call themselves Kids in the Keys. Kids in the Keys, oh golly geez. We have fun and also joy. Kids in the Keys, live by the seas. Life is very fine. Rattatees and dolphins, boats everywhere. Everyone swims and loves sun and shine. So come along and join us. Adventure today, and we'll make a memory. Jacqueline and Maggie, I am so excited to have you here this morning. Now, we just showed our viewers your Kids in the Keys theme song, which was fabulous. Good job on that. Why did you girls decide to start Kids in the Keys? Well, I think we decided to start it when I was about seven and we went to Greece and we were like, what do we do with kids and like, what are the cool things to do? So we decided to look on the internet we found this girl who had a website that was all about things to do in Greece, fun kid things, nice restaurants. So we're like, whoa, you know, we could do that too because we're young and it's in the Keys. And we just loved um, iCarly. Mm -hmm. And so they did a similar thing. And it was funny and just absolutely fun. So mm -hmm. we decided to go for it. When we got more interested in it, we showed our principal, Kelly Mangle of Treasure Village Montessori. And she um, suggested to make a community link. Mm -hmm. So it's to um, like pick up the beaches, um, water safety, and protect the marine mammals or yeah. the marine life. Well, you girls are really making a difference then down mm -hmm. here. And you raise awareness about a lot of different issues. And one of those issues also that you raise awareness about is cystic fibrosis. Why that? Um, well, I have a very, very mild case, and we're trying to get more people aware of it so we can find a cure. Okay, well, great. And now, okay, since Kids in the Keys is all about things to do down here in the Florida Keys, what do you girls like to do? Um, well, I'm a big horseback rider, mm -hmm. and I also love the water and all the sports down here. It's just so much fun. There's so many things to do. Mm -hmm. I like to dance. I have dance titles sometimes. Um, uh, I also what I also love the marine life, and I like that we have a small community and we know everyone. Mm -hmm. so. Yeah, it's a beautiful place down here, isn't yeah. it? And now, do you girls hang out all the time? Yeah, yeah. we're like sisters. Yeah, yeah. You're like, but you're not sisters, but... Yeah, but we're like sisters. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. How long have you girls known each other? Your um, whole life? Since we were babies, yeah. Since you were babies. So you, I know you have fun yeah. with this project and everything. And I also saw some videos of interviews that you've done with some people in the Keys. Yeah. Do you have any favorites or do you just like them all? Um, I think we just like them all. I don't think yeah. we have any favorites. Yeah, tell They're our viewers about some of the people you've interviewed. Um, well, Wylan the artist that was just so amazing we went to his house we got to know the real Wylan it was really cool and our friend James Olson he's a rocket scientist so we interviewed him Thanks. up in Colorado well you did great in your <laughs> interview so I'm a little nervous because you guys might take my jobs one day <laughs> do you have dream jobs um well mine is a veterinarian I always loved helping animals mm -hmm. I want to still help them <laughs> and what about yours that's the same exact thing. I've always wanted to be a veterinarian. I love animals. I, when I was little, I used to like play doctor all the time. So mm -hmm. I've just loved it. Jacqueline and Maggie, what would you say is your future goal with Kids in the Keys? Well, like Jacqueline said, um, we want to show kids the fun things that we can do here. So we're trying to make that happen. Mm -hmm. So you just want to keep it growing and, you know, in the future, 
just have more fun stuff on the website. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Because I don't think you can ever run out of stuff to do down here in the Keys, can you? You, you really no. can't. No. <laughs> and I also noticed from the website that you girls love to travel, don't you? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Do you have a favorite place that you've been to? Um, mine is Ireland. Mm -hmm. What about you? Mine is definitely Paris. Is there a place that you haven't been to that you want to go to in the future? Um. I want to go to Germany because my mom's, um, my mom's mom, um, her mom was from Germany. Okay, okay. And what about you? Uh, I kind of wanted to go to Australia. <laughs> nice. Because of all the wildlife there and stuff. Well, I want to go to Fiji, so maybe the three of us can all go <laughs> yeah. to oh, all yeah. of these That's places nice one place. day together, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. Well, thank you so much for being on. I think what you're doing is so great. And what do your friends think about this? Um, they know. like it? Yeah, I think yeah, they do. Yeah, most of our friends. Good. Yeah. They don't really know that much about it because yeah. they're... They're, they're doing, doing their own school, thing, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think that this is so cool what you guys are doing. Maybe even some of your friends will get involved with you oh, in definitely. the future, yeah, too. Yeah, we're so. trying to get that to happen. <laughs> yeah. Great. Well, thank you so much for being on. And if you want more information on Jacqueline and Maggie, you can just check out the info that you see on the bottom of the screen. That's going to do it for me today. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'll be right back here tomorrow. Take care, everyone.